Hello everybody and welcome back to another video by HFAL. Today I'm going to be showing you an amazing chess game in which I was playing as white, uh, as black, and my opponent was playing as white. And this game was against a bot. Um, I don't know if you know the um this bot, but um I think their name was Harry Mac. Yeah, Harry Mac. So um we actually made plenty of blunders in this game. But I still managed to recover and perhaps win the game. Okay, so this is a game. Um, so let me um play the game. So they start with um. The, so the bot is Harry Mack, as I mentioned earlier. Um, he plays the queen pawn opening. Um, we respond to it with the king's pawn, as assuming that if takes, then we can do this. Uh, interesting checkmate so it's this this no wait sorry this and then the idea is that they move their bishop so okay i'll just show the whole thing to you this and then we pin the bishop and it can't take the queen because it's pinned so now um white can move here so let's say that now you can see that this would obviously be mate if the queen was not here because of course the queen would now take but in this case the bishop if the bishop takes queen takes and then as you can see this is mate and black can't do anything to stop it because we lured the queen out of protecting um sorry this square uh, as i just told you earlier so that was my idea it's a 600 bot it might actually fall for that but it didn't i don't know what was the whole point of it moving here um the the thing is the analysis is saying that this this would be the best move um but and this is an inaccuracy but anyways that's how the game goes i play the pawn up because i want to get my knight out um and i guess that um it just completely this pawn is just completely taking over of the entire space so i put the pawn up although the analysis is saying that it's good but um i sure played this pawn up here so like this and then takes i guess that one might be the best move um, but anyways, um, I played d6, um, I mean, not d6, f6, and then e4, um, I don't know what is the point, I think that's just to get the bishop out, um, I take, I don't know what was the point of this, this is just completely blocking in the knight, and the mouse is saying bishop here, to aim for this checkmate so um let's see so i move my knight out attacking the queen and getting um that out um the queen goes here oh yeah and by the way if you see me looking at the um right like to the right a lot it's because the chess game is on my monitor so now this queen is has to guard this pawn otherwise um this otherwise it will be taken by the knight and um so the queen was supposed to i think go over here and sorry not there that's just second queen here because um i think that this would um keep it out of the center and will make it what is going on? and it'll make it easier for um and it'll make it less easy for me to start attacking the queen and gaining tempos so i move my bishop to d6 um pawn to g3 um queen to e7 i i don't know what was the point of that move i'm not sure so in this game i blundered a lot because i assumed 600 bots can't really beat me well looks like what so i think in, i don't know why i'm with the king that's not a good move at all and even the analysis is saying it's a mistake because um oops so 
No, because you're already losing the right to castle, and um, and there's absolutely no point in that move. But anyways, and it's also just completely opening up the file. Like the king is in a completely open file, and I can attack it from any way. So I just completely blundered the knight over here to just take. Simple. It's a blunder. This is just completely winning. Oh god. Hold on. Uh, let me. It's not happening. I actually do that. Okay. Okay, so where were you? We were over here. So, assuming, where, where were we? Okay. So, they did not take. So, this is a miss, as it says. This was completely winning. And I don't know how this bot did not see that. And I just moved my knight back. So, I'm assuming it was a misclick. And I don't know why this is saying to move here. I have absolutely no clue. But I anyways move here. <clears throat> the knight goes out. Although they were saying to pin the bishop, to pin the knight with the bishop, um, and the knight goes out, and now what we do? We move our bishop, um, to attack this square. So assuming theoretically we can do this, although we could have anyways done that. But assuming that, like for example, let's say the king moves back, or let's say the queen comes back, then we can still do that. Um, I don't know what was the point of this. this is an inaccuracy. Um, completely just moving their knight to a random place. If I can simply move this pawn, they lose a the tempo, move back, or possibly even get back over there. So I take the pawn, um, instead of going with my knight, and they're saying to gain the tempo and move the pawn up to attack the knight. But I still took. They move their bishop to attack my queen. And now I should do this, yeah. So, um, <clears throat> I don't know why the king moved there and why this is a good move. But anyways, let's just say, according to the line of the engine, um, I moved my bishop out to um, get a winning. And I don't know how this is a good move because can't the king just take? Okay, anyways, the king goes to c2, I castle, queen over here, probably want, over here, probably wanting to take this pawn and um, start to move attacks on my king, for example, check, and then open up some files, like go over here, but just theoretically, um, okay, I do this, I think that's, comp I don't know why the engine... The analysis is completely locked up. Or, okay, whatever. Um, so, you can simply just take. And then, if take, I don't know why that's such a... Oh, I see. My queen. That pawn is completely protecting my queen. And they still did not see that. They did not see that my queen was completely open. And completely free. So, I probably moved... Wait, what? I didn't even protect my queen. I did not see it. I, sorry, wrong. I did not see this attack at all. And they still did not take. This is just completely crazy. And I still did not take. So now I'm trying to get a new queen. And as the video says itself, this game, I had five total queens. And you, and we can count. So this was the first queen. So now they finally take. So we should be back. I do not know why I did not take. Um, this was just a complete victory bishop, but you can see why it is completely winning. And now they take my knight. Now all I can do is take back. Now they move back. Um, apparently you should have moved here. I don't know why that's such an inaccuracy. And I move my pawn up. So this is about to become a queen. Thank you. So, but they're still winning by eight. But so now they take our pawn, they can just move here and put some threats. But I get a queen, 
and they did not take it with the rope. This was a completely free queen. And this just allows me to make up for that blunder with the bishop. And now I can check him. This, so this would actually be made if the knight wasn't there. Because you can't go here, can't go there. Sorry. Oh my god. Can't go any of these three squares. Can't go here. Because queen. So this would be a checkmate, but unfortunately. So I think the main line would. I don't. So checking this, of course. So if check. Let's see. So if check. Then here. Then here. I think. And then, and then what? This? And how is this made in one? Let's see if we can find it. Um, we take a check, obviously. So, um, I, I don't think this says made in one. Oh, if you take, oh, because of the bishop. So, the bishop is just com completely denied. But, anyways, we do not see that. That would have been a complete win. Couldn't do anything about it, I think. Hardly anything. Um, move back. This is a free knight? Yeah. Oh, wait, the queen. Okay. Well, I move my pawn up. So, this is a complete blunder. So, in my rush to get a second queen, I blundered my... To get my third queen, I blundered my second queen. So, now that tip took obviously um <clears throat> knight over here i don't know why i didn't move the pawn up just because that would be attacking the knight and protecting my bishop at the same time but anyways i don't know why this is a main line um because kind of just move the pawn up but anyways okay so i just blundered a knight i did not see that um king move obviously so this was a completely blundered pawn but did not see it move I don't know what was the point of moving this rook. I think, like, they want to move here, then suddenly attack the bishop. I don't know. But, anyways, I move here. I do not know what was the point. That bishop... This is a problem. So, when you move a piece randomly to do a one-move attack, there's absolutely no point, and you're just wasting a tempo and a move. So, this is not a good idea. But, so I... Queen, take, take. I should have taken with the bishop because now isn't that a free bishop? That, that would be a free bishop. I should have taken with the bishop. You don't think this is a main line? I don't know why. Okay, I did not see the free bishop. I do that. Takes, takes. I should have moved my bishop back. Okay, now I move my bishop. Um, knight attacking the bishop. I'm gonna go a bit faster. Okay, this was just crazy. I think I accidentally clicked this because I was playing on my phone, I think. I'm not sure. But um, this is just completely blundered from two prospects. And it's saying made in 13. So maybe something like check and then over here. Then check takes over here. Check over here. Check. And then over here, and then here, check or something like that. But either way, um, this is only a uh, six hundred bot, so I probably won't see any of that. Um, <clears throat> moves back over there, probably take the pawn, and it does not take it. Um, I just moved my my bishop. I don't know why. This was a miss. Um, he moves here. How is this a miss? Okay, anyways. Um, apparently, I should have moved up here. I don't know why I did. Oh, uh, I think to protect the spawn. Um, bishop over here. I don't know how these are misses. If I go, if he goes here, how is this going to help him? So, one mover. And I would just move here. Check. Done. Um, it wants me to sack my bishop. Okay, um, this over here, wait, so last move, it was main 12 for white. Um, 
we should have taken the pawn. I don't know why this one is just to blunder bishop. Um, whatever. Because a queen is blocking, so okay. I move there. <clears throat> queen goes over here. So apparently, oh, I see. So it was completely winning because this, this, and then um. Uh, there, there would, there might be a mate soon, but um, this is just a blunder. Look, this is just done. And then the, I don't have many other pieces. All I have is a bishop. Besides that, but anyways, I don't know why I moved over to the king. Uh, I should have just protecting my. This bishop is just hanging right here, and they did not take it. They moved their queen, but they did not succeed in taking the bishop. So this was an excellent move. It should be. Um, yeah, it is. Um, I don't know what was so good about c5, but so this is completely losing the bishop because here, here, let's say, um, how is this a miss? Oh, he wants us to take the pawn and then do this. I don't know. Um, well, anyways, um. I do this, takes, oh, that's actually what they do, he actually moves over here, takes, queen move, I don't know what he's doing that, I take, great move, I don't know how this is such a great move, it's one of its, it's one of its two options, that's not a great move, it, it, what would it say if this, how, how would it move this is, this, how is this, how did the engine go so low for that? And how to increase okay anyways um <clears throat> the second pawn okay good this engine is just stupid honestly um queen move on to protect the bishop and advancing pawn oh oh wait oh this is a part so this is when pawn pawn and our fourth queen this would be our chance for a fourth queen Yep, my thing is going to action idea, and this is just a complete loss. Um, I think would be the best. Yeah, this was the good move. So, and they do not take. This is just horrible. They do not take. So I take. I don't know how this is a miss. They wanted us to, okay, let's say we do this, then what? Oh, oh, I see. So, they want us to do this, and then we have to do either here, where we lose a queen, or they want us to do, or they want us to do this, and then they lose a queen either way. So, I missed that, but that's still fine. So I got this, I missed it. I traded queen. Check. Um I'm moving my pawn up. He's trying to block it with the king. And I'm advancing my pawn and I get my fifth my fifth queen, yes. And this is in check. And this is just a complete loss. Um this oh this is main one, so Oh, um, where's the mate? <clears throat> if you go here, that's our mate. Um, what if I check over here? That's not mate either. Where's the mate? This is not mate. BH4? This is mate? Oh, oh, this is mate. You can't go here. Oh, that's actually pretty clever, but this is really hard to see. Um, I move here, check. This is anyways going to be main two. Oh, let's see. Let's do some fun. Um, this would be main one. Where's the main one? R F one plus. Here. Oh yeah, this is made. Uh, how did not see that? Um, queen up. I moved. I moved something to the back right, but I moved the wrong piece. I should have moved this. I feel like after you look at the engine, you feel like you're stupid. 
track, track, and now this is obvious. If you don't see this, then if you don't see the make here, then this that's sad. This is May. Um, this is May. I already found two. This is May. This is May. Yeah, I think there are only two May. So this was the 69th move. That was a lot of moves in this game. <clears throat> no wonder it took so long. Um, it's been 20 minutes already. Just hit the 20 minute mark. So I don't know why it prefers this line more, but maybe just to annoy the king because you literally hit it in the face. But anyways, so we checkmated and we had five total queens in this um excellent game. This was one of the most intense games of chess I've ever played, especially considering that I wasn't even trying because of the um, level of this bot. But I suggest that you also go and play against this bot. Um, you might, you'll probably enjoy it, and um, just if you ever get this type of situation in a game where you have the fifth queen. You're probably not playing that well because if you have to get five queens before you win a game of chess, that's probably gonna mean that you are not able to see any mates. But I just did this video um, to have fun and see all the blunders I made and how many queens I got, which was crazy. Um, I think just the most one of queens I've ever had in one game. But that's about it for this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Thank you for watching this video. You have now reached the end. Please like and subscribe if you like the content. And hit the notifications if you want to see every latest video by the channel. And I'll see you next time. Have a great day.